Today I'm super excited because we're making poached eggs. And I really wanted to make a poached egg because my mom loves poached eggs. But I feel like they're always just so complicated, whether it's stirring water, adding salt, adding vinegar, and it's just all really complicated. But I really wanted to make one for my mom. So she showed me the easiest way to poach an egg, and I'm gonna show you how to do that today. So let's get into the video, but first make sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any future videos, and hit the dinger so you get notified when our next video comes out. Now, let's go make these poached eggs. So we've decided for today's video that we're going to do a poached egg and I'd like to do mine on an avocado toast. So we're gonna go ahead and do an avocado toast with the poached egg. So I'm gonna go ahead and start toasting our sliced bread and chopping up our fresh basil that I'm gonna put on top of the avocado. That sounds amazing. And while she's doing that, I'm gonna get the poached egg ready. So I have a pot and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill it with an inch of water. And you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have a lid for the pot. This one is a glass lid, which helps so you can see what's going on, but this is really foolproof. So you can use any lid, just make sure you have a lid. So I'm gonna go do that. And then I'm gonna stick it on the stove at medium heat until it's boiling. So now that the water's boiling, we're gonna get a silicone egg cup. We have the Cozy Life silicone egg cup, but any silicone egg cup is fine as long as you have one. Even though it's non-stick, we're gonna spray it with some olive oil just so it's easier to release when we're done. So now that our water is boiling, you're gonna to wanna to take a look at the level of the boiling that you've got going on over there. You don't really wanna have such a crazy boil that the water is splashing into the egg while it's cooking. You wanna have a nice low rumbling boil. And once you have that going, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you sprayed your silicone egg cup and moved it all around with the paper towel so it gets evenly around. And then you're gonna to wanna to crack an egg into it once you stick it in the boiling water. But an easier way that we found is that if you put it in a measuring cup or just something else and you crack the egg into the measuring cup, if there's any shells, you can take them out, which is great. And it's easier to pour into the silicone cup once it's in the boiling water. So that's what we're gonna to do today. Once you have the egg in the boiling water, you're gonna to wanna to set a timer for five minutes and then you're gonna have a perfectly poached egg. Now that our egg is poached, I'm gonna get the avocado toast ready. Yum. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut the avocado. I like to use a fork to get the avocado out because then I can go ahead and smash it onto my avocado toast. Makes it a little easier. So now we're gonna make our avocado toast. So right now we have some avocado on there. I like to put a little bit of the everything but the bagel seasoning on the avocado and then put the egg on top and then a little bit of salt and pepper and a little bit more everything but the bagel seasoning <laughs> on top of that and some fresh basil. Now that we have the everything but the bagel seasoning on, I'm gonna go ahead, I've decided I want some tomato slices on mine. So I'm gonna go ahead and slice some tomato. I'm gonna go ahead and put this onto my avocado toast. And now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my poached egg. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna use a knife and go around the edge so that it'll release and slide out of there. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put the egg onto my avocado toast. Look at that, perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and put some pepper and a little bit more of the everything but the bagel seasoning on top. And I'm going to garnish with some fresh basil. Now always the best part of the video, let's try it. Look how good this looks. Mmm. It's so good. It's perfectly poached. It's super gooey inside. The outside is perfectly cooked. You cannot go wrong with this. These are so easy. It's perfectly poached egg. Works every time, foolproof. I'm so glad she liked it and I'm so glad that we could share it with you. I'm having more. <laughs> we really hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching and keep, keep cooking. cooking!